All right, my third intro. I think I have audio. Yeah, I have audio. That's good. All right, let's do this thing. What's going on, everybody? My name is Chris Baird. Welcome back to my channel. Tonight, we're going to be doing a paranormal investigation at one of my boss's haunted properties. My boss is CJ Faison. If you don't know him, you know him. You know who he is. That bald guy with the goatee, that's CJ. This is one of his properties behind me. And tonight, I'm here with one of my friends, Dylan Corcoran. Wait, you know CJ Focus. Faison? Do you know CJ Faison? You know him? I'm not talking about CJ Faison 743 on Instagram. I'm talking oh. about the real guy. So you're not talking about the one that asked me for money? No, oh. no, not him. Oh, okay. uh, believe it or not, we don't ask you guys for money. We would never ask you guys for money. I'm going to keep this intro short and sweet, but tonight me and Dylan are here alone. We're going to be investigating this building. Uh, we honestly have had tons of experiences here because we work in the back office over there. Both of our offices are back there, and a lot of times we hear some weird noises. Just last week I heard a really loud bang when I was back there by myself. It was after work. Nobody was here. I got really uncomfortable, and I laughed. I can't even lie to you guys. It made me really uncomfortable. That stuff happens all the time. But in this video, I'm also going to announce the winner of the three $25 Amazon gift cards, so make sure you stay tuned for that. I'm talking really fast because I'm really spooked out and scared. I don't want to do this tonight, but we have to. So. How you feeling, Dylan? Uh, it's great. I've been here all day. You and CJ left me here. You guys just decided not to come to work today. Well, we had some stuff fun. to do. The, the motorcycles were really, really lonely, and they wanted to be uh, ridden, yeah. so we yeah. had to go ride them. That's why. <laughs> yeah. Because he was here for like an hour, and then he's like, you got it, bye, and then yeah. just up and left. Mm -hmm. so, yeah, it's I mean, bike week in Ocean City. What do you want from us, right? I mean, yeah, I can't really follow When you guys. get a motorcycle, you'll be there with us. Yeah, one day. It would be a little weird if we rode together on the same bike, yeah, so I, I didn't think no, that was a I'm good idea. That, sorry. <laughs> yeah, don't good. do that. No, don't do that. Absolutely not. <laughs> Anyways, I'm going to be announcing the next giveaway in this video as well, so stay tuned for that. Also, doing giveaways almost every video went on from here out just because it's fun. I like giving you guys stuff. It's pretty cool. So make sure you check out chrisbradfilms.com. I'm launching that website. I think I have stuff up for sale. If not, I will soon, so stay tuned to that. And I'm trying to think what else I got. Dylan's trying to run my ass over with a, with a damn really car. You're gonna carry him home? No, absolutely not. Have you ever carried I'm somebody? Just kidding, do not. What's that? Have you ever carried somebody on one of those? It's so hard to do. It is very. It is hard so to sketchy. Do, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, I don't recommend it. I also got my Gator Waders in today, and these are literally like the greatest shoes I've ever oh, got. So if, I, if anybody has like a contact at Gator Waiter, please have them reach out to me. I'd love to do a deal with them. I'll wear them every day for the rest of my life. I promise you guys that. Whew. All right, we're gonna start uh, Dylan's video, and then we're gonna get rolling. We're gonna separate. So uh, make sure you leave a like, comment, subscribe. Make sure you subscribe to Dylan as well. Let's get going, guys. I'm so. I'm excited right now. I got coffee, see all that. I'm amped right now, guys. I'm so hyped. Film some ghost content. Spooky dookie content. I'm gonna be spooked. The spooks are gonna be duked. Oh, oh god. Yeah, get ready. I don't know if I'm ready. Ever since he opened the damn Ouija board here the last time we were here, shit's been weird. I forgot we did that. That's almost like, yeah, I know. And then I also was doing an essay session out there blindfolded. You know, I forgot about that. And he's here Insert clip right here. I also want to mention before we start the video that the next video you guys are going to watch will be at the farm. This video is not going to have any farm content in it. You got to sprinkle in a little bit of something different once in a while. We went at the farm almost every video for the past two months. I know I see your comments. You guys are like, oh, you're just doing the farm. You guys are really using the farm. It's really haunted, okay? What do you want from us? So, Aren't you happy to not be at the farm for once? Thank God. Isn't it nice? That place, dude. All right, so you're going to go into the office, yeah. which is over there, and then I'm going to go onto the lanes. Godspeed. Godspeed? What do you mean? Godspeed. What are you expecting to happen? Poltergeist? I don't know. The lanes have had some weird shit, but not as weird as this lobby, though. Have you the ever lobby? seen the stuff that's happened? I heard about the chairs. you never seen that clip? I saw the video that CJ had experience with the chairs. That was wild. Dude. Absolutely wild. The biggest nightmare. And then that video, it's like, I don't even want to come into this office ever again. I know. We're here right now. Why is it so cold? Do you feel this? Yeah. There's a cold-ass breeze right here. I'm trying to figure out what it is. Is it that vent? No, it's not the vent. There's not even on, I don't think. Yeah. Hang on, I need to grab my other flashlight because I'm already getting spooked out. Oh, it's in my pocket already. I'm good. What the hell is that? Whew. What happened? I noise. I look like this door was just swinging. I see that happens a lot. Hello? What do you think? Maybe we both get our spirit talkers out right now. And we like start running them, then we can compare them like when yeah. we get back. Yeah, absolutely. What do you think? Like we do like 10, 15 minutes right now. We go investigate for a little bit, see if anything happens. We yeah. come back. Yeah, let me change my light color here. There we go. It's a little bit too creepy. I like it. I couldn't see. Creepy. So right, I'm gonna I'm use gonna, the. Let's turn my phone on airplane mode. Spirit talker. Okay. I actually got some stuff I gotta talk about with spirit talker with you guys as well. I found some information out this weekend. I'm really excited about spirit talker. 
Space Hulk is my go to. I get some crazy answers. You hear so many answers I get. Oh, them. yeah. Like, no, it's no joke. Spirit Talker is legit. I'm 100% a believer in Spirit Talker. It's crazy. If you look to, like, and people, to debunk all the people are like, oh, it access your microphone to your phone. No, if you go to the settings, it literally does not access your microphone yeah. whatsoever. No, that's 100% the truth. And I guess we can talk about that now quick. But um, I want to interview the guy. I don't remember his name, but he posted a video on YouTube just a couple weeks ago. Uh, the guy who developed Spirit Talker. And he pretty much proved how it works and how it does not interfere with anything. It doesn't use anything from your phone, the microphones, any of that stuff. Uh, the, like it uses the sensors that are built into your phone to use the spirit's energy to essentially come up with the words. So I thought that was really cool. I'm going to try to figure out who it is. I'll post a screenshot up on the screen so you, you guys can see it and follow him. But he has a YouTube channel, like going through the whole app and the coding of how it all works. I think it's amazing. So um, make sure if you want to use a good spirit app, use Spirit Talker. It's 100% legit. It does not get messed with. Um, I don't know if you saw the video I was talking I about. Did not, but no, you also yeah. sent it to me. The guy who, like, again, like I said, the guy literally, like, shows the coding. Like, he got permission from the per people who own the app, but he developed the app. I don't know how to describe right. it. It's really cool. Yeah, so, that's neat. Though. I wasn't sure about it, but now I'm 100% sold. Like, I, I know it's not that's just so spitting random words out. It's you know? so crazy, too, except the answers that we get sometimes. Like, yeah, 100%. Uh, it's so creepy. I don't know. But so, I'm mean, the spirits are in here right now. I have this little device right here. You guys can come over and talk to it. We can hear what you're saying. Ooh. Say whatever you want. Oh, I don't want to scare you. I don't know why I didn't talk for me though. I kind of want him to scare uh, us. It's my phone. I didn't have audio on. Oh, thanks, though. <laughs> Great. Now good we job. do. We're good. Oh, no, no, we're good. Okay. Good. <laughs> it doesn't so. want to scare me. It doesn't want to scare you either. I don't want to be scared, but I know we're going to be scared, so yeah. it's just part of the fun. There's always you something, know? so. Well, Ooh. thank you for that, for not wanting to scare us. Yeah. I mean, good luck, I guess. I'm, I'm more terrified to go out there than I am to be in here, so. Yeah, I mean, the lanes are creepy. It's They'll really big. Out. There's some cars in there right Is now. Is there? Yeah. Are there people in the cars? There are not people in the cars, but there are okay. some vehicles in there, so. Just don't get creeped out when you go in there and you <laughs> see, like, a reflective good headlight gosh. and tail. Like. I'm freaked out. Before I go out there, though, can you confirm? I've heard that you guys have gotten, like, voices and talked to people who have worked here in the past, like, ex-employees. Oh, yeah. Okay, I don't, don't tell me any people. names. Yeah, there's definitely been people that they've okay. heard voices here. I'm gonna try to pull names. One of the former, like, clean up ladies here, you've ever heard that story? Yes, I heard about that. Yeah. Okay. With, like, the trash cans, why none of the trash cans are out here. <laughs> We're all out there. Yes. Uh, but yeah, no, we've definitely heard talk and we've seen shadows. There's a Ooh. lot out there. So. Spooky. Uh -huh. I'm ready. Yeah, good luck in there. The office, so. um, yeah, I'll be, we'll, we'll meet up in like 10, 15. We'll, let's shoot for like 12 minutes from now. So right. check your time. About 12 minutes, we'll come out. All right. What time is it? It is 10.24. Okay, so 10.36. Yeah. Yes. I'll see you out here. Bye-bye. Good luck. So, uh, like I said before, I do apologize that this isn't um, a farm video. I know you guys like the farm videos a lot, but I do feel like we've been kind of doing a lot of stuff at the farm as of recently, so it'll kind of be nice to switch it up a little bit and do something different. And this is somewhere that I work very often, very frequently, so this isn't really cool because if, if it is really super haunted like we think it is, like we've had good experiences, but this could change how I work every day. This could make me not want to come here like ever like this might freak me out you know so i don't know but here we are out in the lanes and um we're talking about actually opening this up for investigations at some point so we got that bad boy out i know you guys know who that is the haunted clown people left some garbage here we actually did have an auto auction tonight so that's why you're seeing all that stuff but are there any spirits in here with me tonight feel free to make some noises Come talk to me. Come talk to my devices. It's already creepy, guys. Oh, I just hit. Oh, I just turned Spirit Talker off. I'm so sorry. I'm gonna leave it run. It said two things. I'll check it out afterwards. But I missed two words. I guess my volume's not up or something. It's all the way up now. So I'm asking any spirits that are here with us tonight. Did you hear that? Hey, who's over there? I just heard you. I just heard a breathing sound, a really loud, like, I'm pretty sure the camera would pick that up. Who's here right now? All right, now this is a weird issue because my camera has been fine. Now it's acting up. Is there anything you want to say to me? Forevermore. 
That's just like a random, random phrase. It said forevermore. What does forevermore mean? I'm not trying to ask basic questions, but I don't understand what that means as to what's going on tonight. Are any of the ex-employees of this building here with us tonight? Do you reside here still? And I'm asking respectfully. Nobody died here, so it's not like, you know, asking that. But I'm just wondering if there actually are any spirits who do still spend their time here. Or maybe they had a lot of good memories here. You guys hear that? I thought there were like footsteps behind me. Could you just make a quick noise for me? Let me know that you're here with me right now. Make a bang, do something. Thumb screw. Thumb screw? Alright, that's kind of weird, honestly, because <laughs> we use thumb screws on cars for license plates. <laughs> that's kind of like a unique word to get. Oh, that creeped me out a little bit. That's kind of cool, though. That's, they're on that cart. I didn't even think about that. They're, they're all literally on that cart. Maybe we do have employees here. What the hell? Guys, please, like, if you think I'm crazy, please tell me. Like, is that, is that a crazy thing to think? Like, what we just captured? Like, that's, that's good evidence, right? I feel like that's really good evidence. Thumb screw. <laughs> I don't know. Again, I could be just digging there. Yeah, suck, sorry. I don't have enough hands. I need more hands. Hold that thought, spirit. Whatever you just said. Um, I said brazen bull. I don't know what brazen bull is. If anybody could tell me what a brazen bull is, that would be really cool. Sounds kind of inappropriate, but what do I know? I honestly thought there was somebody up top there too for a second. It really freaked me out. Doesn't look like a person up there. I swear it does. <laughs> Can you tell me more about the job? You said river. river. Hmm. There's no river out here, so I don't really know about that one. We got river. You're talking about one of the twin paranormal guys? You're talking about river? I'm joking. I don't know what river means. There's nobody, there's, there's no rivers. Oh, maybe they're talking about the memorial sign with the water in the back. I'm not trying to reach or anything, but. What the f was that? Whoever just banged on whatever that was, the door or the wall there, thank you. I really appreciate that. That was very loud. Is this a ritual? Is this a ritual? No, this is not a ritual. I'm honestly just here to try to get some communication and talk to you. See if there's anything you want to say to me. Could you tell me a little bit about your experience working here? What was it like being an employee of this building? That's what I want to know. I think something banged on like that wall, either the door or the wall. That was super loud. There's nobody here. We've already cleared the lot and locked the gate up. Like nobody can be inside of here right now. We did just have an auction, but everybody's home. That's crazy. I was not expecting that. Can you just tell me a name? I would love to know if you're actually an ex-employee. Could you just verify your identity for me? Tell me who you are. Maybe you know Dylan or CJ or even CJ's mom. Maybe you're familiar with them. You could just say hello and I could tell them that you said hi really try to be respectful with this stuff because um, 
they've had communication with ex employees and I don't want it to be, you know, like I'm trying to target anybody or like I'm I respect the dad 100% and if we're actually talking to real spirits here I don't want them to you know I'm not trying to disrespect anybody is all I'm trying to say like I don't love filming like cemeteries and that kind of stuff just because I think it's a little bit different Alice. I got a name it said Alice I have to ask them if they know an Alice that's crazy thank you Alice for telling me who you are I really do appreciate that I'm gonna spread the message to CJ and Dylan that an Alice said hello and perhaps they had an ex-employee named Alice I don't know it's kind of cool so I, I'm just curious, do you enjoy having people here tonight with you? Do you like when we investigate and try to talk to you or does it bother you? I'm like footsteps again. I don't know Dylan's, Dylan's way like at the far corner of the building back the other way. So I don't think it's him, but what the f was that? <sighs> Y'all tripping. <sighs> oh. That scared the absolute shit out of me. You guys see my leg hair standing up? It looked like a face was next to me, like behind me in the camera. Oh my god. Whew. I need to sit for a second. What the f did I just see? <sighs> Y'all. I gotta watch that back, but I literally looked like somebody was like in my corner, like coming close to me. I don't know if I was just seeing things or if I was like looking at a sign or something that was behind me. I haven't been that uncomfortable in a long time. It, lo it looked like somebody was staring at me, like a face. And again, if it was just like a sign that was behind me, I'm gonna feel like such an idiot, but it scared the actual shit out of me right there. I know you guys probably all think I'm kind of like insane at this point. That's why I want to clarify this really quick. Watching it back, obviously I didn't capture what I saw. If I did capture what I saw, it would have been the most insane piece of paranormal activity I've ever captured in my whole life. It must have been a reflection off of my LCD viewfinder or something. I honestly don't know what it was, but again, I, I saw a face over my shoulder and it was like moving closer to the camera. It was it freaked me out. I, I get chills just thinking about it. It was absolutely terrifying. I can still see the face in my head. It was like just pale. It was empty. It looked very like mean and just... It just looked like it was like coming for me. I don't know how, to, how else to describe it, but I, I know what I saw. I freaked out. I was very uncomfortable. I don't know what it was. I'm very disappointed I didn't catch it. Uh, I didn't see anything in the video that resembled it. Maybe you guys see something that I don't there, but very, very weird, very uncomfortable situation. But I just want to explain that to you all. I freaked out and whipped the camera because I literally, again, thought something was coming over my shoulder. So it was very strange. I don't know. I've never really had anything like that happen before um literally felt like somebody was there I, I don't know it was just it was just an odd situation but so yeah i just want to let you guys all know that i'm not going crazy i just wanted to explain kind of like what happened because that was like a really weird situation for me and i know if i was watching i'd be like what the hell that guy's got to be on drugs or something but <laughs> nothing like that just i think it was just purely paranormal something was just trying to spook me or whatever the deal was and that's about it uh yeah so <laughs> we'll get back to the video but uh, i just want to let you all know that <sighs> damn Again, probably nothing. But I keep seeing things like in the screen. I'm like, what am I seeing behind me? Oh. Hi, spirits. Look at that. Relation. Relation. So Alice Relation. I wonder if it's saying that that was a relative. I'm not the most familiar like with the family members. Um, I mean, I've known CJ and everybody for about little over two years now but i don't really know any of their family like that distantly i don't know any stories of any family members named alice so i don't think it's anything to do with a family member but i mean and alice again it could have been from 70s 80s whenever this business was open or the building was open so it's kind of interesting i don't know um my new uh, camera has bad battery life just so you guys know it says i have nine minutes left in this battery so i might have to stop in a minute and Natalie. switch out batteries um, so we have Alice relation Natalie so we do have two names now so um, Alice and Natalie if you're both here tonight uh, could you tell me what you did here at this building what was your position if you were an employee were you a customer tell me anything you'd like to tell me that you want me to know I'm all ears I'm open for it you can talk into this red light you can talk into my phone that's down here. It's right, literally right over here. 
If it's easier for you, just make, a, make another noise. Bang on a wall. Whatever you want to do. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know it's a little bit different. Uh, I know it's not the farm. I know it's, I know it's not what we've been doing lately, but I'm trying to keep it a little bit original and switched up. I don't want to get bored you all with the same content all the time. And as you know, fall keeps going, we're going to try to hit more locations like the Pokemon Forest and hit a bunch of different places. So again, I hope you enjoy this video. I hope it's good for something different. Um, I'm not going to be filming at this building all the time, but we will be back at the farm this weekend. It actually is cold tonight. I'm wearing a hoodie right now, as you guys can probably see. So um, I do plan on hopefully camping. Hopefully. I've been saying it for a while now, but I really want to camp. Um, so that'd be kind of cool. Spirit box is awfully quiet. Are you guys talking to Dylan? Oh, it's got a weird breeze right there. Honestly, it's weird how Dylan seems to have maybe an attachment, but it always feels like the spirits talk to him more. and They're, they're always talking about him. I don't know what it is, but it's just interesting to me. I don't, I don't know if his attachment, like if they follow, follow him around, I guess. I don't know how to put it, but maybe he's just more open. The whole, everything with the wall water and all that, you know? Find. Find. You want me to come find you? You want me to come walk around and see where you are? We could do that. This isn't like a huge air or anything, so. Help the flight off the United station battery. Where are you? Point me into the direction where you are and I'll come find you right now. If you guys do hear cars, you're probably just hearing them from the highway. So. You guys need a car? Come see us. I don't know if you guys remember last time I was here, I was back over here. Something got thrown. It was actually crazy. Captured on camera. It was pretty nutty. Is there anything you want to tell us? Anything you want to say? Make a noise. Make your presence known, please. Damn. Dylan? Chris. You good? Yeah, it's time for us to get back up. What happened? Yeah. They only make noise like if you're doing a transaction and powered on. Yeah. I shit you not, one of them went off twice. Really? Like if somebody's making a noise. Just making noises. Told me to like back away and all this and find <laughs> noises. And I wow. showed them because I turned off the light. Only one of the terminals lit up. All the other one, like the screens were up, but not the keypad. So it's like something was touching. You, you straight the up got some like legit. Dude, it's all on here. That's like, gnarly. It happened twice. It caught me so off guard. Wow. I was like, dude. <laughs> Like, that's good though. That's good evidence. After CJ texted me, yes, like how the night went. So I like stopped my spirit talking for a second. And I yep. was like, "Hey, here's how it went." I was like, "I'll call you after I'm done filming, and give you an update." Yeah. And dude, all of a sudden it goes it just off. went off. It's, it's good timing. Really this is dude. good. It's what we want. It's 100 percent what we want. Oh, Virgin. I'm talking about you. That's <laughs> I'm, up. Not. I'm sorry. I'm not. <laughs> Don't lie to your viewers, I'm Dylan. Not, Chris. Is Alan wearing a white dress? What's that? Is Alan wearing a white dress to your wedding? Yes. So I thought. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> Got him. No. So actually, I think it was kind of cool. My spirit talker. Um, I heard like a weird noise, but uh, I got. I was asking for names of employees, like respectfully, just wondering if any of the employees said leave this place. I just. I want to know if any of the employees are still here. You know. So I asked, and I got the name Alice, and I got the name Natalie. I don't know if there was ever an Alice here. If you know of any Alices, I have to ask CJ. Yeah, I kind of said that too. I said the rumors are true. See? Virgin. Rumors are true. The rumors are true. <laughs> Just mess with me, don't. No, but yeah, I don't know. Again, the name Alice. I, who knows, honestly. I just thought it was a, kind of a cool question to ask because, I mean, like maybe maybe something. I don't know. I heard a really loud bang over there too. I don't know what the hell it was, but it creeped me out. So, yeah. They are. Things have been moving. I heard footsteps. I. I'm in the corner. I want to get out of the corner so I can see you. That'd be a lot nicer. But yeah. So I don't know. I guess we can. I mean, we kind of already regroup now. I don't know. I just it's just uncomfortable out here. Again, you just don't know what's gonna happen. Yeah. When it's gonna happen. Wasn't there a wrestling ring here last time when you were here too? 
I think yes. the ring was here, yeah. Yes. That was kind of cool. Who you had that? There was these damn curtains that kept moving behind me the whole oh, time. I didn't even know curtains. about it. Shit. And then all of a sudden, here that. comes CJ. You're trying to tell him not to, being a good friend. This jackass is over here laughing like a little schoolgirl. Like, oh, he was loving it. Scary. He like, loves scaring you. Too much fun, dude. I don't yeah. Like you. yeah, he loves it. At least He's a monster. Awesome. He'll be sitting there. We'll just be walking and be like, bam! And then, like, what the Every f dude? Like? Every time. Three. 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 Hmm. Well, two of us and one of them. Top. Three top? Let's talk about the whole thing. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Sorry, that, that, that set it up, alright? What? The light? Oh, yeah, that's the light, I, the light I was using. No, so I don't know. Plan. Plan. We're kind of trying to come up with our plan. No, geez. <laughs> See, you did that one. I was staying here like this, alright? So this is exactly what I was doing. I was staying here. Had my light kind of on me. I'm trying to see if I can replicate it. I don't know what it... But I was talking into the camera and it literally looked like something was coming over my shoulder. Like a face. Like I scared the actual f*** out of me. I have to watch the footage back. I think I saw a face. I don't know. I can't understand it. It was on a little earlier too. I wonder if it turns itself on. Because last week, no, two weeks ago when I came out here to grab something after the auction ended, it was on. Really? In the dark. Just that. Yeah. That's so strange. So I don't know. Just Stuck weird. here. Stuck here. Yes, sir. Stuck here. Yes, sir. All right. See, maybe there are some employees here. <laughs> Brink, are you here with us right now? Oh, I forgot about, you about that name. You're right. Brink. So I, I never met Brink. I don't know Brink. I just heard you guys talk about Brink. Yeah. I never got to meet him, but I What was that? Yeah. See? Hiding. Brink, was that you? Were you hiding? You don't have to hide, buddy. It's okay. We're friends of CJ's. Whew. Man, something's just creepy out here. I'm telling you. It's so much colder out here. It's very cool. It's very creepy. Someone got some Royal Farms chicken and didn't save any for me. Oh, there's some in there. Should I eat it? What's that? 10,000 likes and I'll eat this piece of chicken. Oh, God. Someone left some Royal Farms chicken and it looks good. So I said 10,000 likes and I'll eat it. Why? I probably do it for like 100 likes right now. Honestly, I'm so hungry. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't eaten since 12 I'll eat some chicken. No, what the fuck was that? All right, everybody, really quick, I just wanted to stop and announce the three winners of the $25 Amazon gift cards. Uh, I wish I could give all of you $25 Amazon gift cards, but unfortunately, even $75 is a lot for me to be spending right now. But I love you guys, and I love the support. It's been amazing lately, so I figured it's the least I could do for you all. Again, thank you so much. I'm laying down in my bed right now. I've been editing all day. Honestly, the editing itself isn't difficult. It just takes so long typing in all the captions from the spirit box, so it kind of tires me out a little bit. So it feels good to be laying in bed just chilling for... I don't know, the next five minutes while I film this and then upload it. So, um, yeah, I'm going to stop right now uh, on my blabber and announce the winners. So I want to say, as I sit up, uh, congratulations to uh, Let's Chat and Create Resin Art for the first winner. The second winner is Brandy's Unboxings and More. And the third winner is Just Me, Me Renee is the name of the account. So uh, check your YouTube accounts. I posted screenshots of the channels themselves. So if this is you, check the comment, check your YouTube notifications. I commented on your post with the instructions on how to get the gift card. You need to contact me. I need to get a hold of you. So once again, thank you all so much for entering. Again, we had a like, record-breaking comments for my channel, like 2,500. And again, I'm not doing it just to drive engagement. I'm doing it because I love you all and I want to give back to you all. I really do. I think it's fun just reading all the comments. I read, I had to have read at least a uh, uh, three quarters of them there's so many but i just read through them and scrolled and scrolled and scrolled as i was in bed the past few nights and it's just hard to fathom the the amount of people who you know show love and, and just uh, support me so once again i know i blabber all the time about uh being being grateful but i really am I'm grateful for all of you so thank you so much it really does mean the world to me and yeah i'm gonna get those out to you as soon as the three of you email me the next giveaway i'm gonna do is only gonna be one but i'm gonna put together a really cool prize pack from madcon 6 MadCon 6, if you don't know, is a paranormal convention in Madison, Ohio that we go to every year. Well, this will be my second year going, but I'm going to go every year from here out because even if I'm not one of the guests, just to go support because I love it so much. It's, you get to meet so many amazing paranormal creators and investigators and psychics and everything. It's just a really cool event. 
I almost forgot to tell you guys how to enter the giveaway. It's really simple for this one. First of all, make sure you're subscribed. If you're not subscribed, you cannot win the giveaway. Leave a like on the video and then leave a comment with the word MADCON, M-A-D-C-O-N. That's going to get you entered to win the prize pack that I'm going to put together from the event. So this is in Madison, Ohio, September 29th and 30th. If you live in that area, you can still get tickets and go to the daytime event. Come meet us, have a meet and greet, check out all the shops, go explore a little bit. But I'm going to put together a prize pack from that event. I'm going to get your size. And I'm going to send you a t-shirt from the event. I'm going to put a picture of the shirt up, which I think is really cool. Addy designs and makes all of these, which are awesome. Um, so you're going to get a shirt. I'm going to put together like a little prize pack of some other stuff that I find there from vendors. Uh, I'll buy a couple things and throw them in the package. So this one might not be as uh, cool as a $25 gift card, but I just thought it'd be neat to give you a little piece of the convention, especially if you can't go and you want to be a part of it. Um, yeah, I could try to make something cool happen. So if you want autograph signatures uh, for many of the people there, I can make that happen for you as well. So once again, thank you all so much. Uh, I'm going to try not to lay here too much longer and get up and keep editing, get the video up for you. It's currently Sunday. I'm supposed to be dropping this today, but it's not going to happen at this point. So tomorrow, Monday is when you're going to see this. So yeah. I just want to thank everybody once again. Hope you're enjoying the video, and I'll catch up with you in the next one. What's that? I don't see any bugs. Something was literally just attacking me. It felt like someone grabbed my ankle. Wilson. It said Wilson? Wilson. That's weird. <laughs> Wilson. Touch your leg. Wilson might have touched my leg. Thank you, Wilson. I'm, I mean, it's good that we should definitely collect these and keep an eye on the names because, again, if there is, like, an actual employee or somebody here, yes. it'd be cool to know... Maybe Terry knows, you know, CJ's mom. Maybe somebody does know some of these names. Right. And again, we're just trying to, like, just communicate. Yeah. It's not like we're trying to pull them back. I don't know what Brink's last name was. There's a plaque in there. Oh, imagine if it was I Brink Wilson. Actual. Wait. Who's that? My spirit talker. Oh, my spirit talker's over there. Okay, I was going to say, what the hell was that? Okay. <laughs> that, that was definitely a voice. I was like, no, no, I know way. his actual real first name, but there's a plaque in there. I think it might be Wilson. That's a cool look. Like, all right. That's, that's actually, if it is, I'm going to. I'll be no good. I'll be no damn good. Wait, I, I might be exaggerating here, but I don't know what it's like. <laughs> I think it might be. But. That'd be crazy. This just said Navy. Navy. Oh. Was he in the Navy? Uh, I don't know. Blonde hair. Blonde hair? It's describing somebody. So it just said, yes, sir. Yes, sir. And Navy would go together and then blonde hair. If he turns out that this Brink guy was in the Navy. His last name's Wilson. Know. We might be under the greatest discovery dude, ever. Dude, I don't know. You got DAE. Oops. The blonde hair, that. like, I always just overthink it. When I start saying stuff related to my personal life, like, my fiance's hair is blonde. That's like, true. It told me poltergeist when I was in here. Did it? And people were talking about my last video. I don't know if you've seen it, Chris, where I talked about the shit going on in my life. Yeah. Dude, plates, like, flying out of my cabinets, breaking Which and stuff like this. That's scary as hell. That's activity. Scary as hell. Like, right. Yeah, let me grab a battery really quick. Keep All recording right. if you don't mind. Hello, everybody. Welcome to the office. Which I've never actually watched that show. It was this terminal right here. Was it? What's going off? This fourth Damn. one down. I've never really been here with the no lights on. Let so. me see. Somewhere in this case here, there's a picture of it. No, it just says Brink. But I don't know his last name. I might have to ask CJ what his last name was. It's possible. Because if it was, that is absolutely <laughs> That's insane. cool. It's a cool piece of evidence if you actually did catch that. Like, yeah, dude, I don't know. Like, I thought the plaque said it, but it just says Brink. Like, so I know his actual first name. Okay, yeah. so I mean. Encounter. Encounter. Sounds like footsteps. Footsteps. As I said it. Hello? There's somebody upstairs? Please do that again. That was great. Insane. Earlier when I was in here, you made one of these credit card terminals make a noise. Can you do that again? Flames. Flames. <laughs> no, 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 no. No fires. <laughs> yeah. No fires. No. <laughs> Actually, fires last time I was here, I laid down right there to sleep, and I had a candle lit right there. Oh, so it's kind of weird that I said that. Yeah. I don't know if it's talking about that, that, but yeah, I don't know. That's why I try sleeping upstairs if they're screaming on a Ouija board. So yeah, I'll how'd that go for you? Not at all. We're not using that tonight. Thank I'm God. I'm good. Thank God. Lucy. Can I see if we got any other names? What did it say? Vernon. Is that a Vernon? Vernon. We have a Vernon working here. We do. We do have a Vernon working here. That's crazy. <laughs> that's actually really cool. That's no lie, guys. We have a Vernon that works here. Yeah, that's why I was We like, can say that, right? It's not, that, yeah. We're not saying last name. Just... No, that's why I was kind of shocked when I said that. Okay. I'm a little thrown off. Somebody 
place and I just like shake that door handle. Yeah, I wonder if I always wonder about that office. It just feels it's so secluded back right there by itself, you know? know. Hello. Can you make another noise for us in here? We don't mean any harm. We just want to know that you're here. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. I, I don't play back my footage for I swear to God, that credit card terminal caught me so often. That's weird. Like, it caught it me makes so you so uncomfortable hard. sometimes. All right, I need to grab a drink quick, and I say we devise a plan where we're gonna go next. Cause I'm either gonna come in here, or I'm gonna go back to the more All right, sounds good. Yeah, I don't really sell much back there, so I don't think we've really shown much back there on camera. No, it'd so, be cool. Something yeah. different, you know. There's that one part we can't show yet. CJ's gonna have to show. I've been watching yes. you. Oh, Ooh, someone's been watching us. I mean, well, we've been here a lot, so you probably haven't. You probably watch us every day, <laughs> honestly. <laughs> Wow, this is wild, guys. Make sure you please let us know if you actually are enjoying this video. I know it's a little bit different than what we normally do, but if you like it, make sure you leave a like and leave a comment. If it's your first time commenting and you have never commented before, leave a comment. If you've never left one before, just leave one. Just say, hey, what's up, Chris? I'm watching, leaving a comment for the first time. I like reading that stuff. I think it's really cool. I want to know when you guys are commenting. What was that? Cancer. That's weird. That's very strange. Yeah. I don't really want to get into that. That's kind of... No. It's a little strange. I'll use my voice. Oh, please do. All right. Yeah, I was going to cut this, please but I guess we're going to keep rolling. Please do it. So, yeah. So, we're going to let the spirit talk around for a couple more minutes, and then we're probably going to stop and figure out what our next plan is here. Um, we're getting some pretty good answers, but not a lot of it's making sense. It's just kind of like random. Like I said, it's like multiple spheres have a conversation, and we're just picking up the taste of it. I know it's just a vending machine, but it's weird that it's making noise like that. I never heard it make that noise oh, before. Never. Somebody messing with our vending machine? Sit and talk. Sit and talk. You want us to sit and talk? <clears throat> I guess so. I guess it wants to sit right out here in the lobby area. I guess we could sit out there and do like a good like 10, 20 minute session. We could just take turns back and forth. Yeah. I'll film half of it, you film half of it, so they gotta watch both of our yeah. videos. Yeah, <laughs> we'll we get you guys, you have to watch yeah, both of yeah, our yeah. videos. See? I like that idea. We'll trick you guys. Yeah. But so, we're trying to keep this entertaining. I don't want this to be like a boring video. So I'll let you go for a sure battery stand to keep dying. So <laughs> <laughs> you're right. You're right. Let me grab my drink and we'll go out there and we'll do that. It'd be kind of cool. Yeah, Alright, everybody. We're here right now. Unexplained. Unexplained. Great. I don't know what that means. But. So Dylan and I decided that we're gonna do kind of like a little joint investigation right now. Um, we're gonna start filming right now with the spirit boxes. We might even do an Estes method. Um, first half of this will be for my video, and then the next 10 minutes after this 10 minutes is gonna be in Dylan's video. So, you know what that means? Make sure you like and you leave a comment on Dylan's video. Make sure you subscribe to Dylan as well. We're gonna, trying to get him to 100k as well. We're all going to 100k. 100k for everybody. If if I make it to 100k, I'll get a 100k tattoo. Oh, 100k. You in? Tattoo. I'm in. I think 100k, 100k tattoo would be sick. <laughs> but um yeah so like that'd be cool wouldn't it that's what i'm saying i'm getting tattoos this weekend i think so no, my hands will be tatted so bad. it's time it's time it's time just this do it be tatted for your wedding i said this is my home so i'm opening up a ghost app right now so just cut them <laughs> cut them <laughs> i don't love that yeah all right, so I am going to. Oh, nope, not that. Necrometer. I'm just gonna use necrometer. You can use spirit talker. Definitely security. I mean, we have the gates locked and everything. We like we're locked in here, so I could see how that would make sense. But we thought about something. Close it. Said. What do you want me to close? Definitely security close the office door. Maybe you have that door open. Maybe that's why, because you just had that stuff happen back there. Yeah. The door's propped right now, so maybe it's saying close that door. <laughs> That's kind of weird. Um, but when we close, or when we were walking back in from the lanes and we got sit and talk out there, if you guys remember the last time we were here, we all sat and talked out there and we did the little experiment with the pencil. Dylan brought that up. I thought it was really cool. So, yeah, I mean, I don't know. It was like a weird night that night. Remember how crazy that was? Full of a bunch of shit that I never expected to happen. Absolutely. I never expected to see a pencil actually move either. Yeah, like, it moved like on command, which was crazy. It's insane. So, I mean, I'm just saying, we got some crazy activity here, folks. Voice. 
See? <laughs> it. Is that what you heard? Who's talking to us? We can hear you now, so go ahead and say it again, whatever you just said. Now you're going to be quiet, huh? Imagine. I said three words and then just stopped, so I don't understand what happened there, but... Imagine just a dude, all of a sudden it sounds like Barney and he just starts talking in the oh, background. Sh- please no. <laughs> I don't want to be that scared. A loved one. I don't know if I have loved ones. Cynthia. A loved one, Cynthia. Do you have any Cynthia's? I don't have Cynthia's in my family either that I know of. Are well, you talking about a loved one, Cynthia? You still work here or live yeah. here? One of the face and family members, maybe? Little girl sings. Cynthia, little girl sings. Whoa. Maybe that's what you heard the voice that you heard. It might have been her singing. Can you sing again for us? I'd love to hear your voice. I know we say it every video, but if you guys see or hear something that we did not, make sure you leave a comment with a timestamp and help us put the story together. Obviously, we're getting different answers with the spirit. What the fuck was that? It literally sounded like someone just fucking like banged on one of the doors. Occurrence. Occurrence. <laughs> An occurrence is literally yeah. what just happened. That was weird, dude. That was wild. It sounded like it was right behind me, like somebody like knocking on a fish tank. <laughs> like you're just being stared at right now yeah. through the glass. As I was saying, make sure you guys leave timestamps because we do miss things. Um, help us put the story together. Again, Cynthia, loved one. What? One. It was one One noise is what it sounded like. It sounded like one loud bang. That's so weird, dude. Just answering. It's, again, I always talk about these apps, and I think the apps are honestly crazy accurate sometimes. I've flipped my tone on Spirit Talker. First, I was like, Spirit Talker's BS. And then it's, it, I've started to come around, and now I'm 100% a believer again. I don't know what it is, but Spirit Talker's been so accurate. What's it like living here at this auction, if, if you're here all the time? Do you enjoy it here? Or do you, are you trying to escape? Insert. Insert. Please don't. I'm good. <laughs> you're a bird. No, I'm not allowed. Not to my wedding day. I'm Jacob. pure. Jacob. Hmm. I mean, J- Jacob used to work here. Yeah. So I don't know. We're talking to employees, but Jacob's still alive, so. Shit. Sheed. That's an old name. <laughs> I thought so shit. <laughs> no, it's just sheed. Is that like a sword? Like has like a sheath on it? Is that what it's saying? No, I think so, yeah. Talking about like medieval days, folks. Where in this building do you... Brother. 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 Hulk Hogan. Brother. Where in this building do you reside? Like, where do you usually hang out? Are you upstairs? Are you in the the wash bay outside? Could you tell us where you like to hang out? So disagree. What do you disagree with? I'm just asking you questions. I don't know what what you're disagreeing with, but... It's literally like they're having a conversation. And we're just getting bits and pieces of it. Just That's what I was here. saying in there. Like, I don't get it. Doesn't really make sense. Hmm. Alright, Dylan, I got an idea. Uh, I'm going to hand you my camera if you don't mind. Next door. Well, it's not what my idea was, but <laughs> kind of in, in a similar sense. I'm going to hand you my camera um, to point at me, and I'm going to put my headphones in. I'm going to do Essie's method with the necrophonic. Okay. I never done a necrophonic. I feel like it'd be kind of weird, but yeah, I don't know. I don't think you gotta adjust anything. I'll just give it to you. Cool. I yeah. apologize for my breathing. I'm gonna try my best to control it. Figure. 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 Can you hear me and everything, or can you see me? Now? Yeah, I can see you. <laughs> no, it said disagree and it said agree. When, make up your mind. You disagree or do you agree? Well, I'm trying to understand what it was talking about. What did we say that I was agreeing, disagreeing with? Uh, living here. You can mute your microphone with your AirPods now by pressing the button. That's sick. Really? Sorry, I just got a little pop up. Let me just um. So everybody believes us. <laughs> Let me open up microphonic. Um. Wait, does this have a spirit? I think Necrometer has a built-in spirit talker thing. All right, sorry, that one's hard to hear. Necro. 
Just the machine? Okay. Love. Loving can hurt. So it's playing through here, put my headphone in, and I'm gonna sit here and just kinda close my eyes and tell you guys what I hear. So it's the normal SC's method. Oh, this is so creepy with headphones in. I hate this. Leave it right here so you guys can see it. It just said Dylan. Hello. Feel free to ask questions, whatever you gotta do, Dylan. Hello. I'll put my hood up. Do you know who I am? Since you said my name. How do you know who I am? Said just said kill him. Wow, that was dark. I mean, why do you want to kill me? whispered really really creepily why do you want to kill me what about me what did I do wrong so do you hear us Stinger. Follow yeah you. follow me where are you following me from long time long time what is the definition of a long time Dylan yeah that's who I am Dylan this thing literally said your name like three times. That's insane. This I is wild. Look at what it wants with me. I don't know <laughs> either. Whew. All right, hold on. We miss you, Dylan. Bro, what the f***? It literally <laughs> won't stop saying your name. I swear to God. Who is this that we're speaking with right now? Poltergeist. What about a poltergeist? Keep running. Demon. Kill you. Why do you want to hurt me? Don't run. The portal. The portal? Are you talking about the portal at the farm? Come through. No, I can't come through the portal. You did. I stood in the portal. Sorry guys, we're shaking this. Give us blood. No, we're not gonna give you blood. Why are you so Certainly. evil? Why are you so negative? You messed up. How did I mess up? Water. What about the water? Are you talking about the well water? You did it. I did what? The water. What about the water? You talking about the well water? Transport. The transport the well water? Yeah. Dominant. Yeah, I purchased it. Mistake. Why was that a mistake? water what about the water you're wanted why am I want it get out no how oh bro you good I feel like someone just like pinched my hand my hands like burning right here what the you just said get out and then it pinched your hand dude this thing like I've never used necrophonic with like headphones before usually it's hard to hear what it's saying but yeah. 
It's so clear. It's crazy. I have chills. My hair is standing up right now. That's what we did at the farm that one time for me. It's crazy how well it works. Ooh. I apologize. This was shaky, dude. I was, like, good. nervous the whole time. I kept really? saying about my name. Like, it said yeah, about said, killing me, water. I remember water a bunch, which is kind of weird. Yeah, and I said, well, what about the water? Are you talking about, like, the well water? And then it said, like, you messed up, like, and all this. I mean, what did you think it was? Like, what was your opinion of that? I don't know. I feel like the answers you're getting... And it says it's from a long time. I think it might be like people were saying in my comments. I might actually have an attachment. And I somebody mean, had said that when I opened a well water. You. You. Yeah, you have an attachment, dude. Just confirm it. It said you. People were saying in the last video that it was laying dormant, probably from like when I was a child. And when I opened the well water, it realized I was embracing it and it woke it up. That's a really good theory. But that's, I mean, that's kind of what I've been saying for like joke with you about it but i really do think that you woke something up inside of you and open yourself up to this stuff more i really believe that it just confirmed when it said to you that is not fun that's crazy I, I mean i know that was like a short session but i it's just so interesting how the messages get related you? next time i think it'll be cool when i do that well, i'll actually like screen record it because i think it'll like record the audio oh yeah so that they so. hear stuff that we don't hear right you know, it's hard to do that a lot of times with the other devices we use it's hard to like record what we're hearing but at least with that if we do it again tonight i'll screen record it and you guys can actually hear it. I, didn't, I didn't even think about doing that but that would be smart because we miss things and like when you're in the moment like that like i can't hear what you're saying i'm just having like a thousand things thrown at me and trying to decipher book book it's said a book at the farm are, that's what i was just thinking yeah, the, bo the book thrown at you <laughs> i said I how mean, are you before that it so remembers you or it follows you or something dylan this is crazy Sorry, I don't have a camera like, back. I don't even know. This like, that's honestly really cool. I don't know what <laughs> you are feeling or how you. I mean, it just basically confirmed what my fear was when I was explaining that video. I mean, everybody told me I should take a break from the paranormal. Not gonna do that. Sorry, I'm just not. I'm not smart. I'm just gonna keep trying to get more answers. Oh, we're just trying to film videos and trying to get some good content. It just is what it is. Like I need to know more answers. Like I need to know where it came from why it's targeting me it needs to leave Ellen and the dogs alone now I don't like that well you were talking about getting a haunted doll well, I don't know if that's a good idea Dylan yeah I might get one <laughs> and put it in like a box or something like in a glass yeah. case so this way kind of keep it locked up I don't know you're wild if you actually do that that's crazy what do you guys think you guys know all the stuff about Dylan Dylan's potential attachment which seems to keep bringing itself to fruition every time that we film do you think Dylan should get a haunted doll? Do you think that's a good idea? I think that's a terrible idea. You're gonna have stuff, your apartment is gonna be like the damn conjuring house itself. There's gonna be stuff <laughs> happening in every room all the time. Oh, I don't man. know, dude, that's kind of sketchy, but I don't know. What do you guys think so far? I mean, is it, is there something here? Like, again, we work here every day, so we, we experience things and the spirits are probably a little bit more comfortable with us because we are here so often, positive. Um, yeah, and the spirits know us, they, they see us all the time. I truly 100% believe this place is haunted. I just, I don't know, the the 10 minutes I spent out there, the, what we just had happen. Spirit Box is pretty active tonight. I mean, or is it just you? Do you just bring it with you? I don't know. It's always active everywhere I go. Yeah, no, I don't think it's, I don't think it's just you. I think there is something here, honestly. There's definitely something here. We've already seen that. We can confirm that. Yeah. And I think it's, oh boy. That's not a word that we want to get. That's 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 a really bad word to get when we're when we're filming here. But um, yeah, if there's something demonic here, could you please take the door? You, you could probably just kind of squeeze through the cracks there. Just leave. We don't want any demonic entities here with us tonight. I hope that your attachment's not demonic if you do have one, because that that kind of scares me a little bit. So what do you think? Do you think it's like a positive thing? Do you think it's a negative? It's so tough to tell. Like it plays games and all this. So like. I feel like it wants to be positive, but like a yeah. lot of people are saying, like people are like, it's high demonic Sorry. and it's just, once I started to embrace this paranormal more, and that's why I was I lived here. Before, I lived here. Like, people were saying that once I started to accept it, they opened the door for it and all this. And I have like weird shit happen when I was a kid, and like, I think that's why I didn't want to deal with the paranormal for a while. Yeah. Now Makes it's sense. like back. Like, it's back in full force. <laughs> it's creepy, right? It creeps you out a little bit. I don't know. Don't love it. From a long time ago, so 
so it was before the conjuring house clearly like yeah and like you said you just opened it up when you went to the conjuring house i mean it could have been you guys have been so many different places it could have been from anywhere honestly childhood any of that stuff the fact that it's I kept hearing, there's a few times I didn't say it because I, I heard it so many times. I kept saying, Dylan, 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 Dylan. I don't know why. I don't know what the infatuation is. I don't know why. It's definitely getting, it's, it's getting it. We're, we're paying attention right now. That is that I lived here. Retaliate. All right, see, this is absolutely targeting you right now, 100%. I just said retaliate. Incorrect. Incorrect. It's not targeting me. I don't know if I believe that. I think it's trying to mess with us. It's trying to make you feel comfortable. All right, guys, I'm going to turn my camera off for a little bit. Uh, make sure if you're not already subscribed to Dylan, go over and subscribe and jump over to his video and watch all of his video because um, you're going to see the second part of our spirit box session right here in Dylan's video. Once we're done with uh, the, the rest of the spirit box session, we'll jump back into this video. So catch you all in a few minutes. It's literally thrown me off my game now. I did not expect it to confirm anything. Like I did, like spot on. That's great. That's great. Andrea. Audrey, Andrea? It's Andrea, really. Andrea, Andrea. I mean, the names you're getting are just it's very strange. good to collect, but the fact that I said something so similar twice is always weird to me. That's very strange. Uh, it's up to you. If you want to go out there, I'm going to go in here for a few minutes. We can figure it out and I'd we'll meet I'm back up here. again. Yeah, I'm going to go out here. Oh, damn, I have to my battery again. Mother. Uh, uh, Alright, guys, hold one pause. For real, last fresh battery. Just went in my camera. Go. Good luck, Dylan. All right, y'all, so I'm going to head back to the um, motivated offices. This is where mine, Dylan, CJ's, uh, CJ's mom has an office back here now as well. Um, I have some weird stuff happen back here all the time, so I figured I'd come back here and see at nighttime what happens. Hello? Anybody back here with us? Us meeting myself. Do a lot of like print work and stuff back here, but if there are any spirits back here, I'm inviting you to come communicate with me right now. You guys probably know me, my name's Chris. I work here. They'll spend time with me here all the time. I'd love to communicate with you. Someone above me just... That was weird. That was literally like upstairs directly above me. I don't know what that was. Wow. Alrighty then. We're going to start this investigation off like that, huh? Can you make another noise for me? Please? I'm gonna come into the print room for a minute. We can do this fun little experiment we always do. Which I'm sure you guys love. The camera just tipped over, what the hell? Whew. All right, spirits. Come talk to me, please. That's what I'm here for. Got this fun little device with us that we use all the time. Voice recorder. Try to see if it's gonna work, it might be dead. I don't know, it's turning on right now. All right, so I have some questions, guys. All right, I'm back here in the office I work at every day. I just want to know if any of the spirits of any of the ex-employees are here with us tonight. Are there any good spirits here with us tonight? Are all the spirits here evil?
Is there anything you want to tell me, like your name, or why you're here, or if you need something? I didn't stop it yet, sorry. There we go, now let's play it. All right, I'm back here in the office I work at every day. I just wanna know if any of the spirits of any of the ex-employees are here with us tonight. Are there any good spirits here with us tonight? Are all the spirits here evil? Is there anything you want to tell me, like your name, or why you're here, or if you need something? It's not like I said help. That was weird. I'm pretty sure it said help. It was like help. That was crazy. All right, I'll give it one more try then. Can you tell me what you need help with? I, I just heard you through my device right here. I'm holding. You said help. What's the issue? What are you having problems with? What can I help with? Is there somebody out here moving around? Because I can hear you. People don't usually stay here this late at night. Usually everybody's gone around five, six o'clock. Do you enjoy the company tonight? Do you like having people here after hours? Let's pause this for a second. Can you tell me what you need help with? I, I just heard you through my device right here. I'm holding. You said help. What's the issue? What are you having problems with? What can I help with? Is there somebody out here moving around? Because I can hear you. People don't usually stay here this late at night. Usually everybody's gone around 5, 6 o'clock. Do you enjoy the company tonight? Do you like having people here after hours? That was cool. I feel like I got two pretty good. I, I don't know. It's not like I said I do. I, I'm I'm all messed up right now. I lost my train of thought because that was that was gnarly. I don't usually get stuff with their voice recorder. I do once in a while, but to have stuff like that come through, it's pretty cool. And I don't think it's that bad tonight. I think it's like, like I don't think it's evil or like harmful. I just think that so whatever's here like wants to talk to us or like just wants to communicate. So. I'm gonna bust out the uh, spirit talker again. Get it going. All right, spirits. So I only have about 15 minutes of battery life left tonight. Didn't bring enough batteries, unfortunately. But I want to keep talking to you. So please, whatever you want to say, say it into my device. Kiss. 
All right, I'm not making that up. It says kiss. Do you want to kiss me? Just because my lips look really good tonight. They look nice and plump. Like Omar always says, give me a kiss. Shout out to Omar. One of the best dudes in this, in this uh, paranormal field, for real. Sounds like someone's walking around out here. Do you guys like when we're like staying still like this or would you rather have it so we're like bouncing all over the place? That's what I'm wondering. I just don't know what you guys like. I feel like I'm sitting too still right now, but I also don't want to just be whooping my camera all over the place. Hello? Someone's walking around out here. I said kiss. I know that's not very serious. It's all just joking, but what's it been like having us here tonight? Has it been fun for you? You been enjoying our company? We exorcise you. No, no, no. No, that, no, that evil stuff. Dylan? What up? You good? Yeah, I was just setting the alarm and done, dude. I can't do it no what more. What happened? I'm just not feeling comfortable. It didn't want to talk to me out there, but I just felt like something kept touching me and watching me, and I was like, all right. Holy <laughs> like, yo, you're all right. <laughs> like, so I was like, I'm going to set the alarm since when we're done, we can just get right the hell out of here. <laughs> I just said we exercise you, and I got so uncomfortable, so I walked out here, and then you were walking towards me, so that was perfect. Oh, well. Dude, this... I don't know if it's just this place, I don't know if it's just something me, but it, I'm just not comfortable. It's weird. I don't ever get uncomfortable, like, this filming. Like, just being by yourself? Yeah, like, but I'm like... You got, like, ten more minutes in you? Maybe? What you thinking? I, I was thinking... I'm gonna have you sit in my office, okay. like with the lights off, and do like an Essie's method. I'm gonna sit out like in the print room. Yeah, that's fine. We'll do it for your channel. I already ended off my video. You're done? Yeah, I'm okay. done, dude. I just wanna film for a few more, cause I feel like I'm getting evidence back yeah. there. I feel like we'll I had voices come through. I got headphones back in my office. I okay. can pop them on. I can, uh... I mean, you're honestly back there more. Maybe you should sit in your office chair and you can just do it through. I mean, I can, I mean, I don't know. Let's do it. Right. While we're here. So yeah, if you want to stay in your office, I'm gonna stay in this. I'm just gonna stay back in this journal area. Burial. Burial. Oh, it's the burial. All right, but let's go check out Dylan's little crib back here. It's messy because CJ and them have shit. Like yeah, I know we got all the stuff from the house and everything, but. But it's a little messy. And we're doing a little renovation. I got so. paperwork from the day. And it's really not bad. Like, just a little editing suite over here, but. Got my headphones in my pocket from listening to the Eagles game earlier. Are they gonna win or no? They won. 3428, I don't know. Alright, you know, you know. Blind squirrel gets a nut once in a while, you know? Hey, I mean, we're 2 0, bud. Okay, so. I'm kidding. kidding. How are the Colts doing this year? I don't. I haven't watched the game yet, so I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> oh, boy. Alright, so you let me know when you're good. And just necrophonic. Necrophonic. Say whatever you hear come through, and I'm just going to ask some questions quietly out here. And if it starts getting crazy or something, I'm going to come get your ass and wake you up. Alright. But we won't do it super long because I know that's getting late. So, you good? Alright, I'm starting now. Alright, don't want to start, folks. So, we're going to come out here. I just want to get far enough away where I can hear him, but I also don't want to be in the same room. I'm going to sit down in this chair. Alright, I got Dylan alone in his office right now. Is there anything you want to uh, say to him? He's I'm over here. Where are you? Jeez. Can you tell me what over here is? Damn, I can't hear him in here. Can you say Dylan's name for me?
annoyed? So I'm just making a lot of noise instead of annoyed. Why are you annoyed? We're gonna stay a little longer. So close. I think it's um. There's a lot happening right now. What if I don't leave? What if I stay the night? You gonna try to hurt me? I'm a man. You're a man? That's cool. What? Oh, I just said my name. My name is Chris. It's correct. You must be smart. We fight the darkness. We fight the darkness. Do I have good spirits and maybe some protectors keep me safe? You know, I don't like evil spirits. Death. Death. Yeah, we're all gonna die one day. It's true. But life, life is fun. I enjoy life, so please keep me safe. Can you promise us you're gonna keep us safe tonight on our drive home? No following us, no harming us. None of that. Church bell tolls. Church bell tolls, that's creepy. <laughs> what are you trying to say? If you're actually here right now, you. you can see me. What color hat am I wearing? So they need you. Where do they need me at? The church? Church bell tolls, isn't it? Mortary. Metallica zone? Mortary? This is saying some evil death shit. It said mortary. Church bell tolls. It even said death when I came and sat down over here. Child. Child. Hmm. Are there any children here with us right now in the room? Come talking to my device I'm holding with the red light. So I'll know you're here with us. It hurts. Are you in pain? Are you suffering? Wherever you are, what is it like? Can you tell me about it? Is it warm, cold? Is there snow on the ground? What is it like where you are? Just trying to ask some different questions, you know? Back. Are you in the back of the building? You guys probably can't see this, but there's actually a door down there. You can see the door. And the, um, sorry, my camera's not focusing. Naturally. But there's a room back there. Behind that door. And um, it's not gonna be probably for a little while, but one of these days we're gonna, we're gonna show you all that. Cause there's a, no, really, not here. No, not here. There's a really creepy room back there with, um, say something hidden is on where they say. But when next time CJ comes, we'll go investigate. They'll see. They will see when we go back there. 
probably the creepiest place in this whole building, but we're going to wait for CJ to come to go explore that. He's not here tonight, but next time we come film this, that'll be pretty cool. When you guys are making loud noises and bangs while we're working, is that to scare us? Or is that just to let us know that you're with us? Is that a good good bang? I truly wonder that. Like, are we... Frank. Hey, Brank, my name's Chris. I know you used to work here. Are you doing all right? You need anything? Hello. Here. Table. Dylan. <sighs> Leave. Brank, do you want us to get out of here? Is that what you're saying? You want me and Dylan to go home? was that? Help him. Hello? Did you guys hear that? That was loud as f What do you need help with? Or who are we helping? Is it Brink? Is everything okay? Damn, that was loud. Something just made the loud bang, whatever it was. Girl. Girl? Having girl problems? No, but seriously, is it one of the girls earlier? Was it Alice? I'm innocent. Innocent? That sounds like something I don't want to get involved in right now. Damn. <sighs> crying? Who's crying? Are you okay? Where are you? We'd love to come help you. If we can help you, let us know. I'm blessed for sure. It feels so uneasy back here right now. I know Dylan's just down the hall, but it is just a strange, strange feeling. I feel like I'm being watched from all over the place. Yeah. Killed them? Dylan just said I killed them. Can you tell me why you killed them? Did they deserve it? Or was that an accident? Did you like working here? Did you enjoy your job? Do you miss it at all? It's like the one banging her glass again. It's that same void. Don't just like kill him again. I swear something just banged on like Need the glass help. over there. I said, need help. Dylan said that too. I hear your cries for help. What can I do for you? Can you tell me that? What can I do to help you? Go. Go? Want you. No, you don't want me. I wonder if it's bad that we're here. Like, are we interfering with things? Maybe... Maybe they're in trouble or they're, they're, they're being punished for us being here. Maybe there's some bad entities that are here. I don't actually know. One more time before I leave. If there's anything I can do to help you, please let us know. Kill them. Is that the second or third time I said that? Year. What year was it? All these killings happened. Tell me. Chris. Leave. Chris, leave. Okay. 
I'm gonna be respectful. I know it's been here for quite a bit of time. I want to thank there's you for. There's two of us. There's two of you. Yeah, we kind of gathered that too. Thank you for communicating with me tonight. I'm not gonna argue. I've heard some crazy noises. I've had some weird experiences already tonight. I'm good. I'm pretty content. I mean, yeah, I don't I know. Maybe this wasn't like the most eventful night that I've had, but I've had enough evidence to be like, something here, folks. Definitely something here. I'm gonna go wake up Dylan. Ooh. Damn. Yo, Dylan. Yo, Dylan. Yo, Dylan. You good? Yeah, I'll say something now. I'm like. You're saying some shit, Dylan. What do you mean? I was saying some shit. Well, I killed them, I killed them, I killed them. Yeah, I don't know. I literally. Girl was, crying? I was like, it literally. I do remember the girl crying. It literally was a girl crying in my ear. That's so weird. But I like was just in a trance. He was like, I don't know what I was saying half the time. I don't know what was happening. You said my name the whole time, which was pretty cool. There was so much. I screen recorded it for you. Let me stop screen recording. Cool. I don't know if they'll be able to hear the audio, but dude, there was so much. There was like eight voices talking at once over each other. Was it really? It was like one right after another, and I couldn't process what I was hearing because it was just like going. Like one thing after another. And every once in a while, it's like a faint whisper, and I would like yell something in my ear, and it back to multiples talking. Like <sighs> That's so crazy. It was good. I, it's just, I heard a couple loud bangs, and it was like not the wildest stuff, but it's just enough to creep me out. And it's like Chris leave. Uh, and I said go when I asked what kind of help I needed. Like it wants us out of here. So glad we did this. I think this was like a fun little video for something different. You know, I got, we were trying to sprinkle some different stuff in between all the farm content. So thanks for coming out tonight, Dylan. Thanks for well, you're already here, but thanks for yeah. Thanks for coming out, anyways. Um, I think we could just wrap this up. Congratulations to all the winners. Make sure you enter the next giveaway as well. Don't forget to do that, folks. But yeah, we're gonna get out of here. Um, let me know in the comments what you thought of the video. If you liked it, if you didn't like it. Farm content coming this weekend. We're going to hit the farm hard this weekend. We're going to bust out the tent. It's going to be crazy. But as always, guys, love you so much. Thanks for the love and support. And uh, we'll catch you all in the next video. Have a good night.